Hello YouTube. I am going to do a video on everyday carry items that I have on my person. Okay, so I learned about everyday carry items from other videos I saw on YouTube and it started to make sense to me that you know what it's probably a good idea to have things with me uh, instead of just keys in a wallet because um, there, there's a there's been a bunch of times where I'm in a situation where gosh I wish I had a knife for this or I wish I had you know, I wish I had some tools or something I, I don't have anything you know and, and I'm stuck so uh, I decided I looked at a few videos and, and some of these everyday carry items can be elaborate you know and, and uh, um, I made mine simple and uh, and I kind of added to it so anyway um, the everyday carry items I have are these okay first is a pocket knife second is another knife but it's a Swiss Army knife with multi tools on it speaking of tools I also have a Leatherman and lastly flashlight okay so those are my everyday carry items so I'll go through each of these pieces and why I carry them okay so first one is the pocket knife okay I did a YouTube video on this on this knife and more uh, and it's titled big five knives and you'll see me on there and I'm reviewing these knives uh, a little more in depth but anyway this pocket knife is good to have because I mean it's good to for prying things um, for cutting things off opening a box I mean how, how many times have you had to open a box or something and you had to either use your fingers or and then the tape won't go and then you're ripping the box up and you have to get a pen and you start jabbing the, the the tape with a pen and or you use your keys and then the keys get all gummed up with tape and I mean right I mean can you guys relate so anyway pocket knife so it doesn't have to be something elaborate like this or anything you can just get any any pocket knife I just happen to like this because this is a k-bar pocket knife and it's pretty cool looking and plus I also have that option of using it for self-defense because you never know these days and since I can't conceal carry I have a knife I got to be able to do something so anyway pocket knife okay second thing okay so a second knife why a second knife well because this is bigger okay and this is where I would have it for self-defense a bigger knife legal bigger knife okay this one there's a blade on it as any Swiss Army knife has um, but it also has a bunch of little tools. I mentioned having tools with me. So I did a, a knife review on this one as well on my Big Five Knives YouTube video. But this one has a blade, a can opener, a nail file and cleaner, a bottle opener, a wire stripper, a, um, I said can opener, right? A, a flathead screwdriver, a, um, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a reamer. And of course it has uh, tweezers and a toothpick so if anything if I carried one thing it might be this because um, well you know Swiss Army has a reputation these are very good knives and they have great function tools on here okay so I carry that the next thing I carry is the Leatherman okay I got this at Big Five as well but I did not do a review so let me go through this real quick so the Leatherman is a multifunction tool. You can say that it would replace this, but I like having the extra blade knife and extra tools. You know, I maybe I'll take one or the other, but for right now I carry both. So anyway, the Leatherman tool has a rule. It's a oh, I'm sorry. Let me show you what it is for all you Leatherman leatherheads. This is a Leatherman kick and I believe it's it's probably the 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 low end full size model of Leatherman tools, but you know what? A Leatherman is a Leatherman. It's very good quality, heavy meaning it's made well with good materials, um, and it's it's uh, it's got a very good reputation. Um, oh, I forgot to do this part. It has measurements in metric and standard English okay it's got the Leatherman name on here and this 
This plier right here is a needle nose plier, a um, regular plier, and a wire cutter. So three tools right there in one. Okay. Um, let's go on this side here. It's got a can opener and it's got a Phillips head screwdriver. All right. So I mean, very basic tools and a nice compact package. Okay. So this one right here has a bit more on here. This is a lanyard holder and I don't use it but I guess you can you know, when you close it up this would be sticking out and you can do one of these things or you can attach a loop to it and then you can attach a carabiner or something carabiner like that and hook it onto stuff or your belts or belt loop or whatever but I don't use that personally oh I don't use it because I have a case alright okay so also got two flathead screwdrivers and a blade obviously this is the blade very sharp very nice um, let me put this loop away alright now I've got a question here I didn't exactly see it in the instructions but um, okay here's two sizes of the flathead screwdrivers and priors you, know, you can pry stuff with it because like I said Leathermans are pretty stout um, I wanted to take a look at this okay see this notch right here and this notch right here and then this little indentation there I imagine that there are tools for something oh against my shirt you can see it better okay so you got this notch here that notch there and this indentation so I guess they serve some kind of function I don't know what it is so any of you Leatherman experts or fans out there that know what that those things are for let me know comment you know um, I'd really like to know I'm sure it's something ingenious so anyway that's the Leatherman with case okay so um, and the last thing is a flashlight okay so why a flashlight well haven't you been in a situation where you're driving at night, car breaks down, and you have no light? You know, this is it. It is a LED. I'm sold on LEDs now. They're very bright, um, and they last a whole lot longer than your average bulb. Um, plus, I like it. I, two reasons why I like these lights. One, it's very small. I mean, look at this thing. Okay, compared to a pen. Okay, this is a Here's a pen. It's shorter than a pen, okay? And just as big. I mean, look at this thing. You know? It's very little. Plus, it uses a AAA battery, okay? Which is a lot easier to, to refill and to find than it is for watch batteries. Because you have all these cool little LED lights, LED keychain lights, and they use like those little watch batteries. And, uh, and I know you can get them at any drugstore and grocery store. You know you can buy them, and you can probably buy you know a bunch of them. But they're a little expensive, if you notice. So if you get regular AAA batteries, or even AA batteries, if you have a bigger LED light, they're a lot more common. They're a lot less expensive, and uh, you know quite frankly, I I I think it's just a matter of accessibility and and you know more than anything. So. So anyway, it's pretty small. I mean, look at this. And I can carry it in my pocket, and the batteries are plentiful. So, so that's why I have uh, a flashlight. So that's really about it. So anyway, um, if you have any comments, please comment, and uh, make sure maybe make sure you upgrade or get started on your everyday carry items on your person. Okay. Well, take care and be safe.